So we're all trying to figure out how to crack YouTube shorts and this Twitter thread is an amazing resource. So shout out to Patty Galloway. Please go to Twitter and look at this Twitter thread because it's very long and there's a lot of amazing findings. I just can't talk about them all here. But they analyzed over 3.3 billion views on YouTube shorts and they found some really interesting things. So the first question is how long should your shorts be? And actually the longer shorts performed better. So while it's called YouTube shorts, actually shorts that were between 50 and 60 seconds got way more views. When it comes to content itself, I love this tweet because it's there's no shortcut, there's no like silver bullet. Good content is going to keep people engaged. So when it comes to understanding the shorts algorithm, it's really simple. YouTube is gonna personalize recommendations of shorts. So they're gonna look at someone's history and then they're gonna show them good, enjoyable content that will hold their attention. It's that simple. So sure, there's a lot of these like data points that we can look at, but like in general, focus on the content and try to make interesting, engaging content first and foremost. When we talk about YouTube shorts, a lot of creators will talk about how they are very good at bringing in new subscribers. But what's interesting in this study is that it actually showed that long form videos brought in more subscribers than shorts. However, it did note that because shorts are so much like shorter and it takes less time to produce, the output versus how many subscribers that you get is greater than long form video. So even though you're getting like more subscribers from long form video, you can create so many more shorts in the same time it would take you to create a long form video. Again, go and check out this thread. There is like 20 to 30 little points in there that are all super interesting. And thanks again to Patty. He mentioned that he usually only shares this with his clients. So thank you for making this public and it's just really helpful info.